A grieving mother and her lawyer are being targeted with extreme abuse after suing a conspiracy theory newspaper. The Irish Light falsely claimed that the mother's son died from a COVID vaccine. The newspaper and its supporters have been abusive online, and the lawyer has even received threats of execution. Conspiracy theorists have been spreading vaccine misinformation using tragic deaths. This case is believed to be the first where a relative has sued. The Irish Light included the woman's son and 41 others in an article suggesting that the COVID vaccine caused their deaths, but it was actually revealed that her son had died by suicide and had not been vaccinated. The campaign of abuse following the legal case has been shocking, causing other relatives to hesitate in taking action. The woman and her lawyer are pursuing a civil case against the editor of the Irish Light for harassment and defamation. The article published a photo of the woman's son and others with the headline Died Suddenly, which has been used on social media by conspiracy theory activists to link unexpected deaths of young people to the COVID vaccine. Deaths from COVID vaccines are extremely rare, and many of the other young people featured in the article died from causes unrelated to vaccinations. The woman says that the Irish Light did not contact her for comment before publishing the article. The legal case is not seeking retribution or compensation, but rather aims to protect the integrity of the woman's son and her family. It has been funded through donations and pro bono work. A restraining order has been issued against the Irish Light editor, prohibiting her from contacting the woman or using her son's image without consent. However, abusive posts about the woman continue on social media. The police are actively investigating the alleged harassment. The Irish Light has not responded to requests for comment. The case has similarities to other victims of conspiracy theorists, such as Manchester Arena bomb survivors and parents of Sandy Hook mass shooting victims.